一度は許す二度はないどうわけまえろ知れ者が来てない Hello guys welcome back To my reaction channel today, we're going to be reacting to Jujutsu Kaisen episode 13. Now, guys, in the last episode, I am so sad that that boy Jinpei or whatever his name is had to die. It seemed like uh, right when they were having dinner, his mom and Itadori, bro, he seemed so genuinely happy, bro. Like he, there's hope for him because my man was depressed and lost beforehand, and now for Itadori to witness his death because of this curse, bro. These curses do not care about human lives at all, man. This curse almost fooled me because. He was so playful with this kid Jinpei, but nah, in the end, he was just a tool to be used for him to gain respect from Sukuna. But Sukuna didn't even care because he already made a pact with Itadori, and the pact that Itadori doesn't remember, by the way. So that's gonna become a whole other mess in the future, but I'm here for it. So now the sense is here, and looks like we're gonna have a battle on our hands. And uh, yeah, it's not looking good, but at the same time, Itadori's pissed, and I think he's gonna whoop ass bro that being said if you enjoy my reactions you know what to do let's go but this kid dying bro i really thought he was gonna live his mom died he died and he was disfigured before he died yeah he has a weakness let's go Sounds like a plan! Itadori Yuji ni chui o harai tsu ga. Mame na porcupine! Kore ii to omotta n da gado na. Yatta kawasareta shi. Kawasareta ato kyodo no yowai hashi kara kezerareru. Zako sen yo da na. Yame yo. Oh, he survived. My man shrinked into a child, bro. What the hell is happening? First of all, it's two on one, and neither Itadori nor his sensei are weak. And this curse still had the cojones to go. Right? He, he was still confident enough to fight him. Right? But now he's escaping, as it seems like. Uh, okay. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> so Itadori is obviously stronger than these cursed humans, right? But he's not gonna go for the kill because he knows those are humans. And this curse counted on that, so he would be busy because he's a natural enemy of this curse. But the sensei, he's in trouble because this curse is not a good matchup for him. <laughs> He got him! Oh? Oh, uh, he did it, didn't he? That one told him, please kill me, and he did it out of mercy. That's how he he adjusted his viewpoint. Now he sees it as mercy. Yes, I killed humans, but there was no turning them back. So that was mercy. That was me saving them. And now he's here to whoop your ass and save his sensei. <laughs> He about to be exercised. <laughs> Is he powering up? Yo, domain expansion. He can finally do it. Oh, you! Damn, you guys told me to watch the opening. I forgot again, bro. You're gonna kill me. You're gonna kill me. Let, let me. Let me. Let me go back. Let me go back. And watch it. Let's see it. Those eyes, bro. The grandpa. 
Okay, that was a dope little opening. That was a dope little opening. <laughs> I have to admit, I was focusing on the subtitles or rather the lyrics of the song, and and they were really, they were very genuine, right? Like all mankind is bullshit. <laughs> Facts, we're all full of shit. <laughs> Yo, the, the the lyrics, they were on point. Also, the visuals, I love the the part with the grandpa reminding us of Itadori's grandpa and what he said before he passed. I'm telling you, in the future, those words are gonna mean something because the grandpa definitely knew that Itadori had some special powers, right? Because he told him to save as many lives as possible. He knew something. The Gramps knew something. Let's go. Tomorrow. They're trapped. <laughs> Only the senses <laughs> trapped. Oh. Only the senses trapped. Oh, that's messed up, bro. The sensei's gonna die because the sensei can't hurt him. Without Itadori, he probably didn't trap Itadori because Itadori is valuable because of Sukuna, right? Sukuna. And Sukuna threatened him in the last episode. Like, you insolent little creature, what are you doing trying to mess with my soul, right? Not good. Not good. とき<笑> Bro, so my man quit, and even though he can help this helpless girl that doesn't even know what's happening to her, he just refused to do it. He was like, I'm not gonna get involved. I'm just gonna live my own life. And he's focusing on money way too much, which, hey, I have to admit, life is mostly about money because you can't do shit without money, especially nowadays with inflation and all that, right? I'm not saying money is everything, but it's hard, but it's hard out on these streets. <laughs> but uh, yeah, my man's, my man's whole life revolves around money and he even quit helping people, like, out of the kindness of his heart. Like, it would take him a few seconds to, so, like, right? Exercise this curse, but no, he's just letting her suffer a slow death, bruh. He's gonna help her! Oh. He called Gojo after that. Man. Yo, my man realized he's wasting his life, bro. And he has a higher purpose, and that's helping people. Right? And even though he's a bit conservative when it comes to risk and all that, even as a juju sorcerer, right? He doesn't want to take big risks and all that, but he can still help on a smaller scale like he just did with this girl. And I love that he actually called Gojo right after that. And my man laughing because he probably knew deep down that he's going to come back after he quit. Love it. But now, he's about to die. Hey, yo! He busted through! He busted through domain expansion! <笑><笑><笑> Yo, 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 what the hell was that? Aside from him? And that was the... That was a comrade of Itadori's, right? The guy with the wolves and all that? And he said before, when, when Saikuna... Brah. Sukuna was facing him before and he said that he has some potential, some hidden potential. And now, again, he's mentioning something about that, yo, that other kid. 
Yo, what do you want to bet that minute he asked from Itadori? Like, free me when I say, right? For one minute, I won't harm anybody. What do you want to bet that kid's gonna have something to do with that shit, bro? Yo! Sukuna killed him! That is crazy! But I think I know why he did it. I think I know why he did it. It's because Itadori broke into his, uh, right domain infinite domain or whatever it's called right domain expansion and his domain is all about the soul so as soon as itadori entered like this curse entered itadori's soul again and then he faced sukuna again and sukuna warned him there won't be a second time bitch and he killed him on the spot that's crazy he forced sukuna to kill this curse <laughs> Okay. He's going in. There was a decoy. Damn, he escaped. He's laughing. Arega no roi no ryomen sukuna. Genji ten de wa jogo yori jiryoku no soryo de wa otoru hazu. Tsugi wa dou koroshite yaro ka. But he can't kill his soul. Sukuna won't let it so. Ai te to iwareta desho. I was right. Demo ore. Kowatte ne yo. スクナが出たのではなくが、奴が入ったんです。うん。ちょっと助けたのは俺じゃない。こいつの気まぐれだ。死は万人の執着ですが、同じ死は存在しない。それらを全て正しく導くというのはきっと苦しい。私はお勧